And now to Benue State, where government has sealed the largest pure biotech ethanol production plant over violation of safety standards that led to the death of a welder and injured another. Mayo Walkwato reports. This is the biggest ethanol production company located along Makadigboko Road and has been sealed by the Benue State government due to non-compliance to safety standards that has led to the death of a staff and injury of another from welding explosion. Officials from the Benue State government acting on the directive of Governor Isent Alia arrives at the company premises to meet with the officials of Pure Bell Tech Company but were not attended to by the management to explain what had led to the death of Mr. Theodu Wisdom on the 22nd of March this year. After an hour of waiting, the Commissioner for Justice, Mr. Fidelisium, requested for the Chinese expatriates work permits only to see that some have expired and then moved around to inspect the facilities. The team hands down their verdict by sealing the plant as explosion on the 22nd of March had claimed one life. In line with the core duty of the government, uh, the governor, the duty is to protect lives and properties of the state. In line with that, His Excellency sent us to come down here and interact with them. Unfortunately, when we came, the management refused to come out and interact with us. But by document and by our earlier interaction with them, wherein we requested for their, the list, I mean the name of who is the safety manager, the training, the certification you have, we found that there is no safety manager, there is no safety plan or, what, or, or whatever form. But I admitted that there was an accident. Somebody died. And that person grossly wounded and in the hospital. Now, this is an accident that would have been avoided. But because there are no safety manager, a company of this magnitude have no safety manager. The company spokesperson says the death was an accident and pledges to fix all lapses. Unfortunately, this thing happened within the time we are looking for a safety manager. We don't have people that have, some of them travel for their holidays. They spend months. When they come back, I will renew their document, of which I have showed the immigration officer that I'm renewing some. We are, going, we are a law-abiding company. We are going to obey the rules and regulations of the Nigeria and the Benway states at large. The company is formally sealed after being shut down pending when all issues raised have been addressed. Mayowa Okwato, TVC News.